Hello, everybody. We are back. Shane Kane, Slavni Holmes, and always with me, Tatiana Slavni. How are you guys doing tonight? Hi, guys. Woo! How are you? It is crazy, crazy out there this week. Very, very busy in the hot real estate market. Yeah, 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 yeah. What are we going to talk about today? Today, we are talking a great topic about how to sell your house for top dollar. Top Get dollar. big money, money for your house. That's what we're looking to do. Nice. Yeah. What's going on with you, Tat? Um, not much. So um, they're slowly starting to lift uh, restrictions in York Region. Yeah. Very, very slowly. I believe we're in the red um, zone. So we're hoping that people are tuning in, but we understand that um, there are some opportunities to get out. Get out. Yes. Um, so if you guys aren't tuning in tonight, I hope that you guys get to watch it tomorrow. And if you're home on Saturday night like we are, come join us and grab a drink. Yes. Cheers. I've got mine here. Cheers. Good night. Oh, good one. Do you want to ask what we're drinking? Yeah. No, no, no. I was going to ask uh, what you wanted to drink for. Oh, what are we drinking for? Yeah. A successful spring market. Amazing. Lechheim. Lechheim. All right. Who do we have on tonight? What's happening? Ooh, can we start from the top? Yeah. Hey, good looking agents. Ronan, you smooth talker, you. Thank you. That's very kind of you. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, no, Polina, it's not apple juice. But uh, close enough. <laughs> Apple cider. Yes, yeah. exactly. Exact Amundo. Exact Amundo. All right. So let me just paint a scene here. First of all, let me talk about uh, what's happening in the condo market downtown. Now, everybody knows that condos have taken a little bit of a hit. Uh, there's a lot of inventory out there in the marketplace. Uh, but we're starting to see a little bit of a, a upward trend. Yeah. yeah. So. Which is, which is great all around. Um, but I wanted to pinpoint a specific article that I just read uh, this past week. A fantastic article that will give you guys hope and understand what's happening out there. Yeah, so there was a condo that, ha went, uh, that went on the market um, and it was at 3 Market Street. And it's right around the corner from the St. Lawrence Market, uh, which is a so great, fantastic a location. fabulous location, right? Uh, but what ha what happened was this is what was interesting. It's a one bedroom plus one uh, plus one. Plus, well, it's got a den to it. Uh, but there was a hundred and forty showings in one week. One hundred and forty showings in one week. I wonder if the seller was living there. That is a lot of showings. Now on top of that, uh, when it came to offer night, there was thirty offers in total. So I've also heard of like 70 offers in a night, 60 offers, 30 offers is still bananas. That's bananas. Especially for a condo downtown. So uh, what happened was it actually sold for $117,000 over asking and it was a record for that building. So typically that building was roughly about $1,054 per square foot. This bumped up to twelve hundred dollars per square foot. That's huge. Tell us why. So yeah, well, why is this? Why did this actually happen? And it comes down to some key things that the seller actually did. Uh, now, number one, you have the location. The location, location is location, key. Location. location, exactly. Something you can't change when you're buying a property. Exactly. But uh, when I post it, I'll actually post the link. Uh, actually, I could do that right now uh, into the chat here. Uh, and you can take a look at the actual pictures. So they actually did some upgrades uh, to the to the uh, actual condo. There was the grouting that was changed in the bathroom, so that looks so brand that new. That is so simple to do. Very simple. We're not even talking about tiles, just grout. Yes, just the grouting, just the grouting. So it doesn't look so scummy and and moldy, right, right after you've yeah. Okay. They changed the lighting, which is which is also very key. It's, lighting it's, makes a huge difference. Exactly, and it's a quick change to the to the entire look of the house. Uh, they changed the flooring. Uh, and then they also repainted, which is also very, very inexpensive a to do. A fresh coat of paint always helps. So also, you'll take a look at the pictures. The pictures show the how uh, the condo and the furniture is fantastic. It looks nice. looks amazing. So that's the big marketing hook to bring people in. And so it could have been staged, or it could be just that person likes had to nice live. Taste. Yeah, had nice taste uh, to their condo. So. Those are the elements that actually brought everybody in. These 140 showings, it must have been, it must have been so crazy. So tell us about this personal letter. Didn't we just talk about it in our last show? Okay, so let me get to that. Let me get to that. So again, 30 offers sold for over $117,000 over asking price. And the winning uh, bidder uh, that purchased the house actually also submitted the personal letter that we talked about last week. 
that uh, they said that, listen, this is a fantastic, this is a beautiful condo. It's in a perfect location. It's exactly where we want to be, close to the marketplace. It's close to the action where they wanted. And they were crossing their fingers, quote, cross, crossing their fingers that they were actually going to be chosen to actually purchase the, uh, the unit. And sure enough, they got the actual got condo. It. So even in this, this marketplace of condos where there's a lot of inactivity that's happening and there's a lot of inventory that's on the marketplace, if you do it correctly, if you market your house and your, your condo correctly and do some, some touch-ups, uh, stage it nicely, these are going to be the top selling items that, that are really going to push you into the advantage uh, zone in, ter in terms of selling 100%. your house. So there are opportunities out there. Everybody's looking for deals downtown, but this was just a nice little ray of light that I found out there in the marketplace now that is slowly also turning that trend to, uh, to seller's market. So we are taking um, a chapter out of this article yeah. and implementing it in an upcoming listing that we have coming up downtown in a condo. Yeah. Um, so we did replace uh, the existing laminate floor with darker with a light, oaky, grayish kind of look. We also did some paneling and we're repainting the place. Um, so I just posted a picture just maybe an hour or two ago on my personal page. I was just so proud of this project. Yeah. Um, but you have to put your best foot forward. It's like me showing up tonight in pajamas. You wouldn't take me seriously, right? Um, if you put on some makeup, you put some jewelry on, you do your hair, hair is done finally, um, it makes a huge difference. So we are putting our best foot forward, um, especially in that condo market. It is very uh, like saturated right now, so you do want to stand out. So um, with everything we do, we always uh, try our very best, and we encourage our sellers to, uh, to work a little harder than they would, uh, put that extra elbow grease in, and you're going to get fantastic results. Right, so, switch, so switching gears now into the residential detached houses also in Vaughan. So what's what's happening? Because I know the spring market's going to be coming. I don't know what's really going to happen because we've had sort of a spring market in the winter time, And then you have the spring market that's going to be coming up, which is typically a time when a lot of people put their houses on the market. People come out of hibernation and they start listing their properties. So what, what can we do now in order to take advantage of that, Tan? So as sellers, we see right now that it is a seller's market. There is definitely an imbalance in the inventory levels with the demand and supply. There is obviously a lot more demand than supply, which creates a seller's market. So sellers have a huge advantage right now. As the restrictions are going to be lifted, yeah. and as we'll see in the next week or two, uh, buyers will notice and sellers uh, that there will be more inventory coming onto the market. Um, so if you are thinking of taking advantage of this market, of getting your house on, on MLS, this is your first window of opportunity since spring 2017, since they put the foreign buyers tax in. Yeah. It's a huge, huge, huge opportunity right now to, to put your best foot forward, to get your house to market before there's an influx of listings and have multiple people, multiple buyers interested in your property and bidding top dollar on it. Yeah, so get that property out there as quickly as possible is going to be beneficial to you because, again, there isn't a lot of inventory out there. So you're going to capitalize on all those buyers that are out there. Totally. Right? Um, so putting your best foot forward will definitely help. Um, we try to differentiate our brand or listings. Um, when we put our, uh, our name on it, we make sure that we put our best foot forward. And uh, what we are offering for you is complimentary staging, not a consultation, not virtual staging, not accessories. We're literally bringing furniture into your house. Whatever the bill is, we will take care of it. We want to make sure that your house looks dynamite. We want to make sure we get you results. We want to make sure because of COVID, you want people in and out as fast as possible. So you want this transaction to happen very, very, very quickly in the shortest amount of time. So we are fully invested in getting you guys top dollar. Exactly. We're investing in you and we're and investing in your into your house in order to ensure that you get top dollar for your house. Right? So it's uh it's it's a great let's it's a great a look, time. Let's see if um, anyone's messaging us. Let's let's say uh, let's see what's going on.
Let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, so he posted the article. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hi, everybody. Hi, Hi Ilya. Ilyas. My father, Ilya Slavny, mm -hmm. our partner at Slavny Homes. Three's a charm. Uh, Nicole says, hi, guys. Hello, hello, Nicole. Hello, Thanks for Paris. joining us tonight. Hi. Very nice. Excellent. If you guys have any questions or I anything. See Ortel said hi. She wants a shout out. Oh, hello, Ortel. I think I missed you last time, so hi. <laughs> if you have any questions, uh, just put it in the chat and totally. we'll be able to, uh, to take a look at it and, uh, and uh, comment on them. Anything so. related to, you know, selling your house for top dollar, you know, any tips, tricks, whatever you guys need, whatever, any questions, um, send them over to us. We'll answer them right here, right now. So how can we position our property? And I know we've talked about this before, but it's always a great refresher for people, especially who haven't seen us or if they're really thinking about it now in terms of setting, putting your house on the marketplace. So what are some of the tips and tricks that they can do right now in order to get that top dollar uh, for their property? Are we doing a top 10? We could do a top 10. Top Let's 10 see. tips on how to sell your house in this market. Perfect. Number one. Dun, dun, dun. So identify your home repairs. Again, if there's anything that you need to do cosmetically in the house that you really haven't gotten a chance to do in your house, do it now before you actually list it. That way people don't come through the house and say, oh, there's a little bit of water stain on the ceiling. Why is that? And there's just too many questions that come out of these small little things. So might as well identify them now, get in the trades and get it fixed. Number two declutter and clean your house so if you're a pack rat like uh, the majority of us are and or like move around and have kids and collect things for many 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 years right if you have a ton of lego on the floor right now because of your children Which is fine. We do too. then we need to clean up we need to get all that stuff out of there anything personalized also needs to come out of there so keep it nice and neutral uh, I know that uh, a lot of you that have, are actually on and a lot of our clients have, uh, have done it in the past and it is, it is definitely a key. So decluttering and cleaning is huge. We, we know it's overwhelming and we've done it. As you guys know, we've recently moved. Um, we do recommend um, if it does get overwhelming to, to hire you know, a person that helps you organize everything. Um, we can definitely recommend uh, a few uh, friends of ours. Um, but basically, um, you can pack some stuff up that you're planning. You're moving anyway, so you, you can pack some stuff that you're planning to take to the new house. Right. Stuff that you guys have outgrown, that you haven't used, or that's been in the basement forever. You can chuck it. You can donate it. There's so many options, but it's a great time to organize things. Yeah, you can do spring cleaning right now. A hundred percent. And just like plan it. Do like three piles. Stuff that you're taking, stuff that you're giving away, stuff that you're donating, and um, throwing it. Wasn't that like a TLC show? There was like a cleaning cleaning house or something like I that? I think it's like home edit something. Yeah, organizing something. Yeah, it's where they, big. It's, yeah, it's trending. Where they just put like a little blanket on the uh, on the lawn and then they said, okay, whatever you want to keep, just put it on the blanket. If it doesn't fit in the blanket, get rid of it. Have you guys seen that? I have. I have. Okay. All right. TLC. Okay. So number three was depersonalize, which you talked about. So anything like your um, university degrees, uh, diplomas, um, family photos out. Uh, we want to make it as uh, neutral as possible. We don't want uh, bars walking around, analyzing who lives here. It's all about them. They, we want them to spend time in the house, envision themselves, their family, which child to get which room, yes, and stuff like that. Number four. Number four. Stage. Staging. Free staging. Well, with us, you can get free staging. Free staging, yep. So stage your house. Again, it is a dream, a vision that you want to sell when these buyers come in through your house, you want them to fall in love with the space and understand how the how the space is actually utilized. So if you have oversized furniture that you know spills into a living room, you need the proper furniture, the proper size furniture in, in order to distinguish those separate areas. Totally. Take, right? take advantage of our free staging. It is completely free, no strings attached. Take advantage of it. We're literally offering it to you. Yes, 100%. Uh, number five was paint neutral colors. Yes. Uh, people like to have multicolored I mean, rooms. What and color, that's fine. What you color can live through it. Ours right now, pink and blue. We're just like everybody else. Like Tiffany Blue. Yes. Uh, so when we want to sell this house, what are we going to do, Pat? Well, we're not planning to sell this house. But um, if and when we yes. do, we're going to neutralize the house. So having like having colors that are calm, um, that are easy to, um, you know, it, it doesn't specify, you know, who goes in which room, makes it like open-ended, really, really helps. 
So again, we are like everybody else. Our kids want their colors. We did what they, they asked us, right? Um, but when you're selling, um, we do recommend to like neutralize it to have a really nice light colors. There's um there's always uh, you know some colors that are trending. Some Benjamin Moore every year. Yep. Uh, Chantilly lace has been huge. Pale oak. Um, Edgecombe gray. Edgecombe gray. HC one seven three. That's what I was gonna there say. There you go. So there there's some colors that you know that our stage recommends over and over again that are easy on the eye. They work with every furniture and people won't um well buyers that come in won't think about repainting the place they'll see that it's nice and fresh and uh, a clean canvas number six uh we have curb appeal so now it's that winter. now that the, the snow is starting to thaw slowly slowly there's a lot of water out there and there's going to be probably some junk on your uh, on your lawn. A lawn, some like leaves, some, you know, plastic bottles, some papier mâché from all the uh, stuff that's been collecting Ooh, there. Papier mâché. Speak um, to me French now, guys. Je peux parler le français si tu veux. Pas wow. de problème. That's where I stop. Est-ce que tu veux vendre ta maison? Oh, here we go. Okay, keep going. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, so Should clean up, clean, clean up your lawn. You could talk to them if we have any uh, French Est watchers. Est-ce que quelqu'un parle français ici? There you go. <laughs> so, uh, clean up your yard. Clean up, uh, do some light, light landscaping. Make sure that the exterior of your home is also just as beautiful as the inside with all the staging and everything else that you're uh, doing, right? hundred percent. So, it's the first thing people see when they drive up to your driveway. You want to make sure that, you're, you know, the front door over time, you know, it starts... Um, getting like dusty and like you know peeling a little especially around the door handle and stuff so just making sure that, like to pay attention to these details sometimes like the doorbell so there, there's gonna be some chips there it's the first thing that people see yeah and first impression first of impression. your house when they drive up yeah. yes and you can tell when people spend money on their house when, when there's a uh, pride of ownership so you want to make sure that um, that first impression is um, you know what they expected so I would try. I would try hard. I would make sure the exterior looks fantastic. Again, weather permitting, right? Yes. yes. Um, and uh, adding some nice planters outside again, seasonal appropriate, um, would really help. Would give like a nice little appeal, um, to um to the entrance of your house. Yep. Okay, so we're gonna get to um, number seven. Number seven. Okay. Yeah. Stock up on your cleaning supplies. So extra gloves and masks. We also provide it for you with our listings. We want to make sure that uh, we have a safe, COVID-friendly environment for everybody to come into. Totally. So hand sanitizers kits. and kits with gloves and masks in there that people can yeah. use, right? Signage as well throughout the house. Please don't turn off the lights. We make sure that people don't touch things. But having yeah. extra cleaning supplies in between showings, you know, to um, to life all the light switches, um, stuff like that will uh, will keep everyone safe and more comfortable with this experience. Yep. Also, number eight, be prepared mentally to have people come through your house. You want to talk about that? It's COVID. It's yeah. COVID. Yeah. Everything has changed. Everyone's a little bit different. Yeah. Everyone's views are different. Thresholds are uh, you know, all over the place. So. 100%. And that's fine. And that's, that's fine. Totally, totally we fine. We have to work with you, and the buyers have to work within your limits as well. But yeah. at the same time, when you list your property, understand that people are going to be coming to see the house. Yeah. Those people that are coming to see the house are hopefully already qualified and that they are serious about purchasing your home. Yeah. Uh, but you have to be okay with them coming in and uh, taking a look at your house. We typically recommend for the sellers not to be at the house at the same time as the buyers in a regular market. Um, with COVID, because we like to limit the number of people interacting in the household, we strongly advise the sellers not to be at home. There you go. Um, number nine, mm -hmm. be properly educated on market value of your home right before you list. Since there's a lot of motion in the real estate ocean. Did you write? I did write that. <laughs> Lots of motion in the real estate ocean. Yeah. So ensure that you have the, the proper value of your house going into, uh, the, the listing process, right? And prices are changing. Prices are going up. So whatever information you received six weeks ago or two months ago is out of date. It's out of date. It's not current anymore. Yep. And you know, as a seller and a buyer, you can go into MLS. You can take a look and see it. You know what's available. But a lot of the properties you'll notice again, sellers and buyers don't see it. But on our end, we see that it's priced for multiple offers. So 
the price that you see isn't necessarily the price that the property will sell for. Right, exactly. And number 10. Okay, we just got a shout out. Hold on a second. Why? Who? Who? So, who, who? Atlanta Jacobs just sent me a message. Yes. Hey, hey, watching your real estate. Sorry. Yes. Your real estate after dark. Uh -huh. You and Shane need your own show. We do. It's called Real Estate After Dark. Dark, dark, dark. We're on it. <laughs> <laughs> thanks, Elena. <laughs> thanks. Thanks for the shout out. But number 10 is, speaking of Tat and Shane. She's laughing out loud. Yeah, I guess. Hire a knowledgeable realtor. Uh, that knows the, that knows the marketplace. No, we're real. We're real. You know, we're not we're not here to to play games here. We want to make sure that you guys, all of our uh, sellers or our buyers, get exactly what you're looking for, and that uh, we're working in your best interest all the time. Hundred percent. So yeah, we are fully committed to getting you guys results. And what we say, we do. What we'd rather under promise and over deliver than over promise. We always try to keep things on the conservative side to make sure. If but you get more than we discussed, it's a pleasant surprise. Mm-hmm. Trank says you look fantastic as always, Pat. Thank you. There it's you it's go. the highlights. And it then, makes a difference. And then Steve commented on that saying Shane looks fantastic too, Trank. Let's be fair. You do look fantastic. Thanks, Steve. Thanks, Steve. But we look great in blue. Come on, honey. Me okay. and you. Me and you. Okay, we have some uh, we have uh, what's uh, a good color recommendation for paint? Okay, so we, we just we talked about the color recommendations, uh, but again, HC173 Edge Comb Gray from Benjamin Moore is an easy color. It's like a grayish beige, which always, always works. Yeah, so um, if you have warm tones in your furniture or you have cool tones in your furniture, it it'll work with both of yeah. them. So it's a great neutral yeah. color. People yeah. like silver sake. Yeah, thanks for the question. Thanks for the question. Yeah, there's, there's, there's some popular colors. If you guys want to send us a message and get a full list, we can. Or if you see any of our properties and you want to ask us, you know, what color was this house painted in? Yeah. Let us know. We're here to answer those questions. You bet. Yes. You bet. So, Tat, why should we be choosing Tatiana or Slavni Homes in order to list our property? We wanted to at least, like, give you a little bit of information uh, out there if you are thinking about listening or listing your, your property. Uh, why, why we make a great team, the three of us, in order to, to list your property. Uh, just to give you some some knowledge, some information about what we do and what we can offer you. So the first thing I always say is that knowledge is key, right? Okay. And our slogan has always been, we, we know, know the, the market. market. We know the market. We analyze it. We make sure that we're positioning your house properly in the marketplace. If there's even like buyers out there, we know, we understand what's happening in the marketplace in order we to live, help you purchase. That we house. live in your market. We live in Thornhill Woods. We've lived up north in Sharon, north of Newmarket. We, we've uh, had investment properties. So we are fully aware of everything that is happening and we're yeah. fully invested as well. All these, all these uh, you know, projects and pre-constructions, all of that. We're all in it as well. So we pass down that knowledge to you as a buyer or a seller or an investor in order to make the, the right business decision for yourself. Uh, we can give you an example, and we actually posted this on Facebook. We had a property that was going to be coming out to the marketplace in Innisville, and it was uh, going to be up for sale. And when we talked to the actual, to the owner, we started explaining to them that the benefit, the benefit of holding, onto it. of holding onto it, leasing it out, right, and enjoying that that income, that positive income, is going to be more beneficial in the long run than selling it right now. Yes, and he was like our our uh, seller was strongly <laughs> opposed. Um, to to leasing it. Apparently he's had like bad experience in the past with tenants and we told him that we're gonna help him find great tenants and that right now that whole area is booming. It would be such a shame to to list it, to, to sell it today, to uh, lose the, uh, the, the HST benefit rebates on there. So we strongly advised and like holding on to it. We see the value, we see the future um, in that area and yeah. um, it's the smart thing to do. Again, not everybody can close and hold on to a property, but um, we, we advise. Um, he really had to think it through because it was out of his comfort zone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I'm glad he did, though. We're so happy. Yeah. And he, um, he actually closed it and leased it on the same day this week. So congratulations, congratulations. Aaron. Yeah, amazing. Amazing. So we also want to keep an eye, a close eye on the marketplace as well because of our buyers as well out there that are looking for something specific. 
you know, understanding what's new, what's coming out on the marketplace, uh, reaching out to our network as well. Yeah. yeah. Reaching out to our network of inform of uh, our network in order to figure out what is actually going to be coming out on the marketplace. So if it does meet your criteria, we're able to jump on it when we can. Yeah. So yeah. if you're looking for like a full size lot, um, if you're looking for proximity to school, a ravine lot, whatever it is, if we have the information, uh, we are very well connected um, with other realtors um, like in, in the um, industry, as well as we know of sellers that you know have thought about selling. Yeah. So we can always reach out and, um, and, or, and arrange things, make sure, give you an opportunity to see that um, property before it goes live on MLS, which would give you a competitive advantage. So your knowledge or our knowledge is also is very key for you in terms of finding that perfect property or selling your house for top dollar, right? So again, also on top of the knowledge, we also have the experience in order to make it happen for you. So combined between the three of us, we have over 20 years of, of, uh, of experience. Real estate experience. So knowing that information, having that background is gonna be beneficial to you, whether you're on the buying side or the, or the selling side, or even just trying to find an investment property in order to uh, in order to capitalize on that. Totally. So. We're going to be running a huge promotion next month. Um, myself, I'll be celebrating uh, my 10 year anniversary in the business. Um, so we're going to have a Cheers huge. Cheers to that. Wow. Thank you. Amazing. You're going to buy flowers? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. yeah. Mm. So we're going to be running a huge, huge promotional campaign next month um, regarding the anniversary. But um, basically, our experience is uh, what we're here to uh, help you with, guide you, give you the proper tools the proper knowledge in order for you guys to make the proper decisions. Um, just um, buying on the east or west side of a street, knowing uh, what is in the, what's around, right? Values, prices, everything is there. It can change from one street to another. You really, really need to know, you know, the actual marketplace that you're working in. And if, um, you know, you ask us to help you in a particular marketplace that we're not working in or we're not familiar with or we're out of area, We'll definitely refer you to um, an, like a realtor in our network, um, but we would always make sure we have your best interest at mind. 100%. So um, we only sell and do and recommend what we're what we've um, done over the years, what we're familiar with. Yep. And um, we're happy to share our knowledge with you. Listen, if we have been doing it for this many years, we obviously know the what market. we know the market definitely, right? Uh, and then it also comes down to strength and negotiating as well, right? So I've always said, and you know, don't don't tell her this, but she's pretty much the shark when it comes out there. She's the, like the Rolls Royce of negotiation when it comes out there. I've seen it time and time again. You are in amazing hands. Trust me. Trust me. So so we make sure we we get you the property. It doesn't matter what it takes. Yes. But uh, if you want a house, we're here to make it happen for you guys. And we do it. And we do it. And our goal is to get it for you before the offer date. A lot of properties will be on MLS and um, with offer dates. So we try we try to be very aggressive. And just to give you an idea, the house that we live in right now, this house here, uh, it came on MLS, and I put an offer on it before I even saw it. Because I knew that once um, you know other agents see it and they start booking showings, that there's going to be too many people interested and the price will be higher. So I actually, again, I'm a realtor. I know not everybody can put an offer on a property without seeing it, um, but we did it, and that's how we got an amazing deal. An sometimes amazing you have to deal. be. Sometimes you have to be right on top, and sometimes you have to be very aggressive in order to get exactly what you want, and we can make that happen for you. A hundred percent. Okay. Can we can we see if we have any messages? I, I want to make sure that you know we're we're talking. Yeah, to we're our good. Viewers. We're good. We're good. Do you guys have any questions? No, we're good. We're good. We okay. got some some new people watching us, which is fantastic. Let's say hi to them. Yeah, Katie. Hi, Katie. I think you're still watching us. Uh, let's see who else. Uh, Kelvin's back, which is great. Maria. Mar no, that's Maya. Oh. Maya and Rafi. Maya. Yes. Amazing. Thanks again for coming out and watching us tonight. Us. Yes, for Real Estate After Dark. Uh, on top of the experience and on top of the knowledge, we are also trusted as well. Uh, so we, we pride ourselves in you know wearing our heart on our sleeve, making sure that we are doing the best job that we can for you no matter what. 100%. It is in your best interest in order to get the best deal whether you're on the buying side or the listing side, or even finding that perfect investment property, yeah. 
we are here in order to ensure that. So it is, it is a key element for our success that there has been some, some good trust between the, uh, the partnership between you guys and us as 100%. well. 100%. And we offer an amazing value proposition. So you're getting a ton of value. Not only are we realtors, we have experience. We're going to guide you through the process. Make sure it's seamless. Make sure that it's stress-free. Make sure that um, everything you need, we have all the tools. So we, we just want to make sure it's the most amazing experience you'll ever, ever have. And we know real estate and stress go hand in hand. Yeah. With us, it's the opposite. We make sure that we have systems in place to make sure that um, you guys feel comfortable, that everything is organized, and that there are no surprises or hiccups along the way. Yep, totally. And it comes down to our service as well. So that top service, again, we have three members in our team. We are interchangeable. We are able to jump in whenever we need to. So I'm Tatiana Slavny. I'm Shane Kane. And our partner, who is my father, Ilya Slavny, is our third member. So we're part of the Slavny Homes team. Um, we speak four languages, English, Francais, Ruski, which is Russian, and Hebrew, Ivrit. So you have service from three realtors in four languages here to help you. And we're always available as well. So if you have any questions regarding anything, regarding your listing, whether or even just real estate advice, we are always here in order to take some of your, take your questions, give you the proper advice uh, in order for you guys to make the proper decision. And before investing in doing big renovations, give us a call. Um, sometimes you see, you know, sellers overspend. So before you do all of that, give us a call. We'll find an easy, simple um, formula, a recipe to give you in order to make your house look fantastic cosmetically without overspending and in a time-sensitive manner as well, right? Because the market is hot right now. Yeah, because we also had some investment properties. We are actually have a good database of tradesmen that are out there in order to facilitate or help out in anything. So whether it's painting electri uh, electricians, uh, you need a painter, you need a handyman, you need movers, you need storage bins. Yep, we're here, yeah. we have those connections, we have those uh, contacts in order to make your transaction as smooth as possible. If That's you wanna awesome. be hands off, you can definitely be hands off. We don't mind getting in there, helping you out, rolling up our sleeves in order to ensure that you we position your house properly and get you top dollar yeah, for so that the house. project can totally be managed so if you don't want to take care of it we'll manage it for you so not to worry okay so the last thing we're going to touch on is the superior marketing plan um so our marketing package is top of the line we offer beautiful hdr is it hdr yeah hdr photography hdr photography yes we have an amazing video tour um, with uh, drone, like a drone work. So you get to see the property inside a video, outside the surrounding neighborhood, you know, from the top down. We have a 3D Matterport tour, which we love using. Um, that tour actually helps um, qualify the buyers. So they get to uh, see your property and walk through the property, like click kind of through it room by room to get an idea of what it looks like without even seeing it. So it actually um, is a huge tool that we're using right now and social media, social media is huge and huge. we're on it. Yeah, so a lot of the print work has sort of fallen to the side because of nothing, nobody wants to touchy touchy stuff. So we've been upping up our electronic game. Our so, social media game, yeah. So the so marketing is going to be key in order to drive people to your house to see exactly what's what's going on inside. The staging again that goes throughout the house. That's another one of our services that we're offering totally. now and for it's free staging. It's complimentary. It's absolutely free. We bring furniture to your house. It's not a consultation. It's not um what is it called? Um like it's not pictures, like it's not digital virtual, virtual yeah. staging. Virtual staging. It's real staging. Yeah. So the stuff you see in our pictures, they bring it into your house and it's absolutely free. So guys, take advantage of this offer. Put your best foot forward. We are fully invested in you, in your property, in getting you results. The market is super, super hot right now. And if you guys want to take advantage of it, right now is the time. Don't wait until there's more homes popping out than, and less buyers. Right now, there are more buyers than homes. So get your houses up there. Get a sign on your lawn. Get us to market your property. We'll price it 
and we'll sell it and we'll get you amazing, amazing, amazing results. It's going to be a fantastic experience. You're going to get more than what you bargained for. A fantastic value proposition. And uh, you can't, you just can't go wrong. This is the passion that we're talking about. This is what's amazing. Am I over the top? I, no, I love it. I love it. Okay. Because, because, this is, because it's coming from your heart, right? This is, this is how much we love what we do. And we just want to help you guys out with any of your properties or any of your real estate questions. Uh, we can manage it. We can help you and, uh, and get you top dollar. So, again, thank you very much for, for coming out. Uh, thanks. I'm just going to make one mention. Yeah, do it. Um, so, our sellers that are taking advantage of the market right now are listing the properties. Um, so, we do have a few listings that are coming out this week. Tell me. Um, so, we do have a uh, townhouse in a new market. Um, coming up close to the uh, the 404. Um, we just have a listing that we listed in uh, Thornhill Woods at Dufferin and uh, Summeridge. Summeridge. Yep. Um, Baker's Lane, 8777 Dufferin Street. Number so 42. that just came on the market. Yes. Um, then we have a beautiful house um, in Thornhill Woods, 67. 59? Which one? It's on Handel Street, okay? 59 Handel. Okay, is it? Yeah. Okay, so on Handel Street, we have a beautiful listing. And that one there, we're going to take pictures of it tomorrow. So you'll see it on our social media on Monday. Beautiful house, five bedrooms, finished basement. Um, it has it all. So And it's a showstopper. It's a showstopper. So these sellers are putting their best foot forward, and they're going to get amazing results. Mm. Jump on the bandwagon. Let's talk real estate. Let's come up with a plan, a strategy to get you guys great money. Great results and to get you to the next chapter. Right. So message us. Give us a call. 416-669-7037. 416-669-7037. Give us a call. Slavni Holmes, Shane Kane, Tatiana, Tatiana Slavny, Slavny. And we'll uh, see you guys on our next uh, Real Estate After Dark. Let's uh, say hi to our, let's say, uh, hi and bye to our friends. Hello and goodbye. Very nice. Your mom is watching. Oh, hi, mom. How you doing? <laughs> Good. Nice to see you. <laughs> Guys, have a much good love. night. Thank you so much for joining us. Yes, have a great night.